So they took that bar off almost immediately before they broke into the cabinet. This is the second break in for feel good CBD wellness in the last three weeks. Surveillance shows intruders shattering the front window, taking products and ripping an alarm box off the wall. I'm just kind of in shock and I'm scared. And if they're that brazen to do this at the break of dawn, I kind of fear for my safety at this point. The owner here put shatterproof glass in the door after the last break in three weeks ago, but tells us this time the intruders came through the next pane of glass using a crowbar to get inside. I'm a cancer survivor and I came out here to try and help people in this industry or to, through this industry because I feel very passionate about it. This cannabis store isn't alone. Staff tell us they spoke with CBD Plus down the street, which faced its third break in over the last few months. While other CBD employees say they're lucky the attempts they've seen have not been successful yet. With a crowbar, uh, with objects, you know, blunt objects, we're looking at, you know, any way that they could actually get in there, hardware, you know, things like that. At Feel Good Wellness, one employee wants to get back to work to provide for her children before the holidays. I haven't been employed in a long time to save money to get presents, so I'm just kind of counting on my paycheck from week to week here to do that because I started so late in the year. Tulsa police tell us since many of these stores are new, it's hard to tell if these break-ins are a trend, but they have responded to multiple reports. In Tulsa, Megan Allison, Two Works For You.